Here's a quick video about changing bases. I'm going to clear, clear my stack here. So the calculator assumes that you enter everything in base 10, unless you specify otherwise. So if I want to convert 10 to a binary, I enter 10, I hit blue shift, and then the base key, and then pick which base I want it to go to. So let's say we want it to go to binary. So I select 4, and it tells me that it's 1010 in binary. We can shift that to hexadecimal too. And that's A in hexadecimal. Or to octal. That's 1, 2 in octal. And back again to decimal. However, if I switch bases, let's just clear that. Let's say I'm working in binary. And I start entering a number here. So I go, I don't know, 25. Again, it assumes that I entered in decimal, and if I hit enter, it will switch that to binary, which is the base that I'm in. If I hit 1010, which if you recall was 10, in uh, binary to decimal, it will assume that that is 1010 in decimal. So if I hit enter, it switches that to binary. Let's say I wanted to enter it in binary though. Now I do 1010 then go to base. I have to scroll down and there's the B for binary. And now if I hit enter it realizes that that's in binary and leaves it as it was. Anyway, just play around, switch bases. It uh, I don't really like having to put the the base indicator there, but that's how it is.